what up, what up, Unbreakable Kicks Army. Yo, it has been a long day so far. We did the What Not live stream this morning for two hours. We moved a lot of good product, Army. And on top of that, I also did drop a couple early pairs of these new Air Jordan 11s now, Army. These don't drop until August. I've yet to do the review on them. But we may do another whatnot this weekend, Army. I'm gonna go ahead and let go some of the Air Jordan 11s. Might do some of these too. So make sure you bookmark the next whatnot live stream. The link is in the description section below, Army. So that way y'all can click it, bookmark the live, and you get that $15 off your first purchase if you signed up with whatnot with that link. Now, today, man, these mean the Chanel's Army. I don't know what's going on. Like, we tried to enter. I wasn't able to enter the raffle at all. Every time I would enter the raffle, it would say something like, too many entries at one time or come back later or it's too many people trying to enter in. A lot of people were saying, like, it's because so many bots are entering on these sites. Like, we remember how it was with the Travis Stops and they say, like, over a million bot entries was entered. Same thing probably happening with these because... Granted, they not a thousand dollar shoe like a pair of Travis's, bro. Like these joints is up. And if you caught my video I posted yesterday, the breaking news army, we got the army forecast, and it's saying that these joints are likely to go down. But seeing how it's such a headache with this raffle, it might go up. We don't know how many pairs gonna be on sneakers app. I heard that the merch this morning got bought it as well, y'all. So. I like the merch. She got some good merch, man. But I was like, you know what? I just wait as far as sneakers out. One, you ain't got to pay for that high shipping. And two, you're going to get it quicker. And you probably got a better chance to get them on sneakers out as we see how this raffle went. So in the comment section below, let me know if you were even able to enter the raffle for that Air Jordan 3 Nina Chanel Army. Like, I can try. It's 158 right now my time, Army. I can go ahead and try to enter this joint one more time because she did send out a message saying that they will extend the time because of all of the headache that's going on with everybody trying to enter into the site. But it's not looking good, bro. Like, if this was an hour raffle and we're an hour in and still ain't been able to get in, man. Like, and I'm still trying right now, y'all, and it's not looking good, so... Again, in the comment section below, let me know that my boy Scotty did say that he was sending me out a pair, but it's release day on her website and I still ain't got nothing. And I don't even know when these are supposed to be dropping on sneakers out, so y'all gotta fill me in with that as well, y'all. But while we sit and wait and see what's going on with those, man, I gotta give a huge shout out to my bro, Fineline1721, for dropping these joints off and also army we know that this weekend is father's day weekend and i always tell y'all i feel like for mother's day they get the red carpet for father's day hey you probably putting down the red carpet we always working on father's day y'all but make sure you show your father or your father figure some love man by going and grab the soul premise sneaker travel bag for 50 percent off army you still have time to save that 50% off because after this Sunday for Father's Day, that sale is no longer going to be running. You can get the new Luciano leather bag. You can get the new luxury leather bag. You can get the athletic bags if your pops go to the gym and he hoop or, you know, he got sneakers and he carry his basketball with him. You can fit all of that in the athletic bag. I feel like that'll be a dope surprise for most fathers. Who do got a little sneaker collection? Who do travel? You know, you got a traveling style army, so click the link in the description section below. Save you 50% off all sold permanent sneaker travel bags. And as always, traveling style. And thank you, boy, later. Now, I took a sneak peek at these yesterday, man, because when Big Bro dropped these off yesterday, I'm like, bro, I think these gonna look good, man. Like, the images that I seen at first, you know the first, first images we look, I'm like, hey, man, them kind of look like some, like some Marquette PEs, bro. Like, what is, what is Jordan Brand trying to do? But the packaging is nice on these. Now, Army, these are scheduled to drop July 6th. So we got about three, three and a half weeks before these joints drop. You got the Obsidian and UNC box. Let's check out the label. Label reads, Women's Air Jordan 1 Retro High OG. 
colorway is university blue. This is a size 11 and a half in women which is a size 10 in men. Now Army, I do have some of these available now, shipping out all women's sizes though. Again, I wanna say it's like a five women through a 12 women. It is dropping right now. Army, if you need them, just hit your boy up. Now, the packaging is nice. Let's look at the packaging. We got like this translucent paper. We got AJ2300. Let's go ahead and check them out. And the leather look nice on these, y'all. Like, Looking at this shoe, it's kind of giving me like a combination of a few things. And we also got something up in here too, like a little card. And it got like some writing on the back of it. Let's see what it says. It says, it's her flair. Like kind of feel like I'm reading like a poem or something. Army say, it's her flair. The way she moves across the hardwood court. It's her record-breaking skills. Her dunking abilities. She's first in flight. True to the game, breaking barriers year after year. Since 1984 and beyond, let's celebrate the many first in women's basketball. This comes <laughs> inside of the box army. I had to get my links and hues on right quick, man. Get y'all some of that poetry, man. But nice little touch, man. I feel like the women Air Jordans, they been adding that, that little spazazz to it, like the women latte joints. It came with the coaster. So the women joints is always getting just that little, uh, that little, that little, that little surprise. Here you go right there, man. So this overall army, I'm liking the quality on them now. I thought the quality may be trash because most women exclusive don't be the best. But this suede that we got around the toe cap reminds me of the Air Jordan 1 University Blues. The men joints that we got a few years ago, same exact suede they used on those. Toe cap, leather plush, sad panel, leather plush. Now they did hit us with like the obsidian blue on the heel of the shoe army, but still nice little touch. Now at first I was just like, man, why did they throw this yellow on the wing emblem, man? It's kind of throwing me off, but if you look at the hang tag with the wing emblem army, like that's, that's not a bad look. It, it really ain't, man. Now, this shoe is kind of giving me, like, three different vibes. Now, I'm going to grab the Air Jordan 1 Marquette PE because this is the one that most people was comparing it to. And to be honest, it looked like they just flipped where you have UNC on the first flights. You got the Obsidian on the Marquette PEs. You do kind of got, like, that beige yellow on the outsole for the Marquettes where you got that Obsidian blue for the Air Jordan 1 first flights. Yellow wing emblem or that beige wing emblem, same thing. So that's where I was getting like the Marquette vibe. And these joints low key kind of favor the UNC's more. Like look at the outsole for the UNC's. Midsole, the heel of the shoe. Now we got the UNC Jordan wing emblem on the PEs, but maybe similar, bro. I don't know, Army, which one would you say that these look closer to? Would you go with the Marquettes or would you go with the UNC that you say the first flight? Or to be honest, it's literally like a mixture of both shoes. Like they took both of these and they made this one right here, man. So I still feel like overall that this is a nice clean Air Jordan 1. Definitely threw me off by surprise. You do got your first and flight right here on the tongue right here with your Nike Air. Clean right here, y'all. We got a spare pair of laces right here, Army. Kind of like that college maids colorway. Again, nice plush leather on the side panel. Suede is immaculate on these joints, Army. This one right here may be a surprise winner, bro. Like, for real, for real, man. And on top of that, I just feel like the Air Jordan ones we've been getting as of late have kind of steered away from, like, the traditional colors that we would get. The University Blues, the the University Reds or the True Reds, and they went more like in a different direction. But this is just, to me, this is Jordan. This is what I like right here. And I feel like a lot of people will like these. So again, Army, if you do want to cop these, pairs are available. Hit me up on IG. These joints are shipping out right now. Go ahead and jump in front of the turntable. Get these joints that up post personal look. Then we can jump right back in front of the camera to end the video off. All right, Army, got the box on the turntable. And again, we got like this Obsidian and UNC box. Dope box for these joints right here, man. Check out the label. Label reads Women's Air Jordan 1 Retro High OG. 
Colorway is University Blue. Again, it's size 11 and a half, which is a 10 in men. Shout out to my bro Fine Line for dropping these off. And here's the paper that comes inside the box. Right, we're smacking these joints on a turntable, man. And y'all can see the nice color blocking on these joints, man. From the obsidian blue, from the university blue, we got this yellow with this maize yellow right here, Army. I'm loving the hang tag. Hang tag is low key complimentary to the sneakers, especially with the yellow on the Jordan Wing logo. Like, Low key, I thought the yellow ruined it, but it low key kind of make these joints pop, man. They do come factory laced with the University Blue laces. We got that first class right there on the tongue, right below that Nike Air Obsidian background, white Nike Air on them joints, Army. Clean, man, clean. Joints do come with a spare pair of the Mage laces as well. And I mean, I ain't even gonna hold y'all. This may be one of the best colorways we've seen for Air Jordan 1s, Azalea, and Okita Women's Exclusive. You see, we got like the nylon or the polyester sock liner. Most of the women's exclusive low key always have that joint. Nice plush leather on the sad panel and on the toe box. Check out the also obsidian blue, also white mid, so white sad panel, white toe. Box, white tongue. This is what I'm talking about. Get rid of all that sale stuff, man. And start putting white on Air Jordans again, man. I mean, but y'all gotta let me know how y'all feel about these, man. It's a couple things y'all can do to keep them clean. As always, Army, the rejuvenated water and stain repellent, especially for the ankle collar. You know what I'm saying? You wear some dark jeans, you don't want that to bleed on the University Blue. You don't want to damage any of the University Blue suede. So of course, Army always get the rejuvenated water and stain repellent, but rejuvenator also have the power pods, man, which make cleaning your sneakers a lot easier. Just think of the magic eraser for cleaning sneakers, man. I got the link for all of these in the description section below, giving y'all that 10% off all rejuvenated product. If y'all like the sole protectors and don't want to get the soles, Dirty. If you want to get the crease protectors, you get the rejuvenator sneaker cleaning solution army. 10% off all of that for y'all, man. So y'all let me know how y'all feel about these. Do these low key kind of catch you off guard like they did your boy? Like these is nice, man. Definitely going to be a sleeper army. Again, I do got pairs available shipping out now. So I'm going to go ahead and get these joints one more quick 360. Then we can jump back in front of the camera to end the video off. <laughs> How do you feel about these joints? I feel like men size 11 and up is going to be mad that they didn't make these in they size. This should have just been a regular release. Men size, grade school, preschool, toddlers. This is where Jordan brand misses the mark sometimes. Certain shoes should just be a regular release. Making these a women's exclusive is limiting how many pairs of these y'all can actually sell. Because it's such a good shoe. Like most of the women's exclusives scream women's exclusive. This just screams dope colorway, dope color blocking. Like, I, I feel like they messed up by making these a women's exclusive, man. For real, for real, Army. Also, again, got that Obsidian. And I've compared these to one of my favorite Air Jordan 1's non-OG colorways, bro. The Obsidian UNC, such a beautiful non-OG Air Jordan 1. Way before it's time, Army. That shoe right there, to me, just set it off for these different color blockings. And these right here, I wouldn't say is a splendid image of them, but it does have those similarities. You also got the Air Jordan 1 Blue Chills, the women's exclusives too. So Jordan Brand know what they were doing by doing these, man. And you also kind of got that polyester sock liner that gives it that women's exclusive touch. So overall, Army, these are nice. Now, if I didn't have the Marquette PEs or if I didn't have... The UNC PEs Army, I definitely will say that these would have been a must cop for me. These are nice. I can't even hold you. This is probably one of the best Air Jordan ones that we've had in a very, very long time. And I feel like the colorway does not disappoint. So again, let me know if y'all need these. Joints are moving. Now, Army, before we get up out of here, to, again, the Nina Chanel's, I wasn't able to enter those, but in my video I posted yesterday, I did drop a couple breaking news, Army. So make sure y'all check those out. The Army forecast was saying that those were likely to go down, but we're seeing all of the hiccups and all of the people not being able to enter the raffles. It's kind of giving me Eric Jordan one lost and found vibes, Army. I don't think we're going to get to that, you know, to that point with these, man. I don't think the demand is that high for these to the loss and founds, but, you know, the price may go up because, again, we still got to wait to see what's going on with sneakers. We don't know how many pairs dropping on sneakers. 
You know, the merch is nice. I feel like the merch is going to sell out. Like, this is a nice drop. I just feel like it hasn't been executed right, man. And I feel like the Travis websites and these and the Balvins, it just leaves a sour taste in a lot of sneakerhead mouths, man. So hopefully Sneakers app is better and we have a fairer chance of actually trying to get a dub on those joints, Army. But again, let me know in the comment section below if you were able to enter the Nina Chanel raffle. Let me know how you feel about these Air Jordan 1 first flight. Beautiful women's exclusive Air Jordan. Let me know how y'all feel about these. Tap in with your boy in the comment section below. And other than that, you got your boy Unbreakable. We got the so premise link in the description section below, 50% off. The Rejuvenator link in there, 10% off. We got the Whatnot link up in there, Army, $15 off your first purchase. And make sure you bookmark my next Whatnot Live. Everything you guys need is in the description section below, Army. Arbit link is down there, too. I love you guys. I appreciate y'all. You got the Unbreakable Vault. Unbreakable Army stands strong. Like always, most importantly, hug your loved ones. And, of course, remain humble. And we out. I hit Unbreakable for the uses. He the plug, call him when I need him. He's old stuff, but he get a music. He always old him first season. The most beefy looking like two laps. Two laps, cause your ass taking nails.